during 1999 there were some persons who made uh, synthetic milk in india just to earn out of it because of the scarcity of milk during some festival season or during summer season they try to make profit out of this bad profession this led to uh, formation of synthetic milk by a lot of farmers particularly Delhi and surrounding areas. Synthetic milk is uh, made by making use of uh, detergent, soda, urea that is being mixed in big machines to make large amount of milk. There are tests which can be used to detect detergent, soda, urea, no doubt, but data they are not being routinely used by big dairies. The tests available for detergent, soda, starch, etc. are very handy, already available in the literature. But for urea, the test was time consuming, it was quite expensive. So we thought of developing something uh, which a layman can use at its own or a big dairies can make use of that particular test in the field along the roadside so that they can check the milk whether that milk contains urea or not. Urea is mixed in the milk in the range of 0.9 to 1 percent to make the protein concentration from 4 to 5 percent. So whatever test we have developed, we have developed an indicator solution which can detect 0.2 percent of urea or above. So if synthetic milk has been diluted to five times even then our test our indicator solution can detect that urea in the milk uh, we took about six months to develop uh, this kit uh, and we applied for its patent during 2004 we got patent in 2012 6th january of 2012 and now we are in the process of uh, commercializing it through some entrepreneurs Whosoever wants to take it from us, they can take it. In this kit, there is an indicator solution which we will be, with, which uh, we have developed. We will be giving that formula to the licensee. So, whosoever entrepreneur wants to take formula for that particular indicator solution, they, he can take it and he can make use of that indicator solution and put it in the kit developed by them or make made by them. They can also make use of uh, adding detergent soda starch testing solutions in the same kit and these tests are already standardized tests and these can also be included in that particular kit along with the urea test developed by us. The principle behind this uh, test is that the indicator solution reacts with the urea present in the synthetic milk or adulterated milk and gives an end product in the form of yellow color which can be detected on the filter paper within seconds. This detects 0.2 percent and above and even 5 times diluted milk can also be detected in the in this by this particular uh, kit. For the for providing license of this kit uh, we have business planning and development unit in our college. Uh, any entrepreneur who wants to take license or formula of this kit can apply to the business planning development unit and we can provide the formula on non-exclusive licensing basis for a particular period on some terms and conditions, mutually agreed uh, terms and conditions and that entrepreneur can make use of this urea kit along with other available standard tests in that particular kit so that any layman, housewife or big dairies can make use of this kit in the field and can check the sample, milk sample for its adulteration with urea, detergent, soda, whatever. As I earlier told that uh, our test of detecting urea in the milk can be incorporated along with other standard tests available in the literature. Any entrepreneur can make combined kit wherein they can provide facility for testing of milk sample for urea by our test. They can also provide solution for 
checking the milk for detergent and for that they can provide 1% bromoprazole purple solution. They can provide 1% iodine solution for checking the milk sample for starch. They can provide 1% rosalic acid solution for checking the milk sample for uh, uh, soda, soda. So these three tests can also be provided along with the kit by the entrepreneur along with the kit developed by us for detection of urea in the milk. So any layman or housewife or field functionary by of big dairies can check the sample on the in the field on the roadside whether that sample contain urea, detergent, soda or starch or not. This is the milk sample, normal milk sample. If we say that uh, we have to make use of uh, our kit for detection of urea, I am adding some urea in this particular milk sample. This is uh, urea, normally the farmers will, uh, which are being used by the farmers or in the laboratory. We are, we are adding this urea into this milk sample. Now, this is mixing of urea in that particular milk sample. This is the bottle wherein we can put uh, our milk sample. Okay. This is another bottle containing milk, normal milk. We will be testing these two milk samples contain, present in different bottles by our test. Okay. Now first we take one petri dish, take one filter paper, we put filter paper on the petri dish. This is an indicator solution developed by us. We will be putting it on the filter paper. You see, one drop each. Because we have two samples, we will be testing one milk sample adulterated with urea, another is normal milk sample. Now we will be putting this milk sample on the drops we have put on the filter paper. This is one milk sample, this is another milk sample. sample. One of the milk sample contains urea. Now, this indicator solution will be reacting with the urea present in the milk sample and giving a colored end product which can be visualized on the filter paper. Now you can see very well. There is development of yellow color around the milk drop that milk contain urea. This is the milk sample wherein there is no development of any color around the milk drop means this milk sample does not contain any urea in it. So you see within seconds, within fraction of seconds you have got the result in the form of a yellow ring on the filter paper which indicates that that particular milk sample contains urea. Okay. We have converted this test into a form of kit. Now we have prepared a kit which can be used for 30 samples. We have provided filter paper in the form of strips, 30 strips. We have provided ring in place of petri dish we have used. This is a um, dropper which can be used for taking milk sample from the field or in the house. This is the forcep which can be used for taking out the filter paper and keeping it on the Ring. and this is the solution which is provided along with the kit. This is the complete kit which can be used for detection of urea. If any entrepreneur wants to make use of uh, uh, other tests, he can also add tests for detergent, soda, starch in this particular kit and he can sell in a mixed form of kit. This is very handy, can be used by a layman or housewife and the home and also by the big dairies which are collecting large amount of uh, milk sample from different places and this test can be performed on the roadside itself. This uh, test of urea can detect 0.2% and above urea. Normally 0.9 to 1% of urea is being used for manufacture of synthetic milk and even if the synthetic milk diluted to 5 times that can also be detected by this particular indicator solution.